Hey guys, Khalid from Cricket Fanatics magazine here, and I'm here with special players. Uh, players that have dominated in the South African scene for quite some time. I'm talking about the Sunday and I'm talking about jo John John over here. But we also got the new guy on the scene, Tristan Stubbs. John John, I'm going to start with you. First and foremost, how excited are you to be a part of this competition? Oh look, it's massive. I think um, any any kind of competition like this around the world you want to be part of and we're obviously very fortunate that it's come to South Africa. So can't wait for, for January to come and really looking forward to it. So from with your type of game, I mean, it's, it's important that you get runs with, and get wickets. How do you focus on both aspects of the game to make yourself where you are today? You, I mean, you've done excellently for the for the Dolphins, obviously moving now and the whole different uh, new scene for you. How's it going your career so far? How's it been going? Yeah, look, I think um, I would have liked a few more runs in this last CSA T20 tournament, but um, that's the way T20 cricket works. For me, it's about just sticking to the, the way I play and sticking to my processes and um, yeah, again, with the bowling, trying to just do the basics well and, and hopefully from there, so far it's working, hopefully it'll uh, long may it continue. Okay, awesome. Tristan, I'm here with you now. Uh, we didn't have an opportunity to talk since you got picked up. Uh, massive price tag. Uh, so how were you first feeling about the price tag? Did you even think about it at all? I mean, I'm, I'm very fortunate for that to happen. So, um, yeah, I'm very, very thankful. You had an uh, opportunity to play at the World Cup. What sort of lessons have you taken away from the World Cup? Yeah, I've taken a few lessons um, just about cricket in general, so uh, looking to bring them into my game going forward. Um, what sort of lessons have you picked up, would you say? Just uh, playing in different situations, um, just like handling those situations, learning from that. Were there any opportunities for you to talk to any of the other opposition from other countries and learn something from them? Uh, not at the World Cup, uh, yeah. Okay, cool. And with regards to this particular tournament, what is your aims, what is your goals for this tournament? Obviously, we want to win the tournament, um, but then just enjoy it. We're going to hopefully be playing in front of a full St. George's crowd, so just enjoy those those games. Awesome. Sasanda, so uh, you can maybe swap with Tristan. Sasanda, <laughs> so long time no talk. The last time we spoke, it was with the Blitz. Now you're over here at the new franchise back in your home city. How are you feeling? I'm feeling very excited. Eh? It's always good to go back home and start where, uh, well, continue where you came from. So I'm really happy about it. How's your, how's your game at the moment? How are you feeling about your game currently? I know you've had some issues recently, um, but how are you feeling currently about your game? Um, I'm feeling a bit not under cold, but I just need some game time to get my skills up and stuff like that. But um, surely by come January, I'll be ready to go. When you, you heard about the SA20, was this like the, one of the franchises you wanted to get picked up by? Uh, to be honest with you, I wanted to, to, to actually be involved in the tournament. So whichever way or whichever team better for me, I was happy to. I just wanted to be a part of the team. Okay, cool. Awesome. Thank you lots, Thank you Asana. Thanks, guys. Thank you, guys. You guys are See you, Tristan.